I realized this morning that no matter what my life experience might be, life is glorious. My God, what a, what a privilege to have life, to experience life, to be aware of experiencing life, to be able to do it consciously and to extend an invitation to other people to live the privilege of their life consciously. There is the opportunity at any time for us to rise above what may be in front of our faces that doesn't speak of glory, that doesn't speak of the, the beauty of life, But the very fact that it's there is evidence of life, right? It wouldn't be there if there wasn't life. It wouldn't be there if there wasn't a creation. And if there's a creation, and there is, then there has to be a creator. And I have my relationship with that moment by moment, just the same as I did this morning on my walk. There is something that, as human beings, I believe that we are about as a primary function. And that is to allow or to respond to the invitations we receive, and I don't know about you, but I receive them all the time, to rise above what may be just in front of me to rise above some of the thoughts and feelings that obscure my experience of this wonder of life. The wonder of life doesn't go away just because I'm having a, a bad morning. It's still a wonderful life. It's still wondrous. And I just happen to be having maybe a bad morning. Can I see beyond that? Can I accept the fact that no, how, no matter how bad it may seem on that morning, it makes no difference to the wonder of life. Everyone on the face of the earth has the possibility and the opportunity to touch the infinite no matter what the outer circumstances may be. Is there some sort of a preset that says, well, this is possible, I can do this, but, you know, more than that, no. And so there's a, a self-imposed ceiling that won't allow us to have that experience of touching the infinite and giving it expression. What it speaks to me of is the experience of freedom, the experience of the freedom of these capacities, particularly of consciousness, to range beyond those preset levels, to go beyond the habitual levels of experience that we've al allowed ourselves, to go beyond the levels of awareness that we've accepted as being normal for ourselves, and to accept that there is so much more. But we'll never know there's so much more until we give ourselves the freedom to feel into the more.